This is Optimal Finance Daily, episode 809, Physically Fit for the Fiscal Year, Realizing Your True Net Worth, by Angelo Poli of metpro.co. And I am Dan, I'm your host and narrator of some of the best blogs on personal finance. And if you have any topic requests, we love to hear them. Please share them over at oldpodcast.com. That's O-L-D podcast dot com. And a big thank you today to MetPro. If you're tired of meal plans and exercise routines that don't seem to work, you should check out MetPro. MetPro's coaches and experts are trained to help you realize what your strategy should be. MetPro is a proven system that helps people to transform their bodies. It works by analyzing your metabolism in order to give you a customized approach to attain your health and fitness goals. Their unique approach to weight management provides you with an unrivaled experience. And Optimal Finance Daily listeners receive a complimentary metabolic profiling assessment and a 30-minute consultation with a MetPro expert. To claim this offer, head to metpro.co slash OFD. That's M-E-T-P-R-O dot C-O slash O-F-D. And with that, let's get right to today's post and start optimizing your life. Physically Fit for the Fiscal Year, Realizing Your True Net Worth by Angelo Poli of metpro.co. A day doesn't go by that I don't interact with a CEO or high-level executive. Everyone rails against their personal challenges, but there's no denying that successful leaders, investors, and entrepreneurs experience similar obstacles. The most successful within this group meet those challenges predictably and consistently. There is a method and mentality behind their approach. As a wellness coach who works primarily with industry leaders, I can tell you there is a correlation between effective self-care and positive and persistent business practices. I know what you're thinking. I'm no financial guru, and that's true, but I do understand the habits and mindset of some of the most successful people in business. Although repping out 60 pounders or surpassing your 5K time doesn't equate to a higher yield from your portfolio, the process and sacrifice involved have surprising parallels that merit attention. Maybe you think your personal health and fitness is not a reflection of your ability to perform in business. Balance sheets don't include a line item that lists the CEO's max squat, right? This continues to be a shifting viewpoint. Google hosts on-site fitness classes and offers community bikes. Asana serves organic meals to their employees. Zappos encourages recess, which is pretty much what it sounds like, but only for adults. More and more companies are building their culture around health and fitness, and it starts with leadership. Healthy executives set the pace for healthy organizations. So the next time you evaluate your business or balance sheet, ask yourself how your personal net worth is impacted by health, longevity, and energy. Business takes sacrifice. Building a successful business or portfolio takes sacrifice. Too many leaders report lack of time, stress, poor health, and troubles buckling their belt among the many sacrifices they've made. Even those who are unscathed by these all-too-common challenges will admit that strong priorities are critical in a world where there's always one more thing to do. Here are three perspectives expert health coaches encourage professionals to consider. One, do you have well-defined priorities? Life in the 21st century is defined by speed. Humans have the same fundamental needs today as they've had throughout history, sustenance, purpose, and a desire to see progress. The difference is the speed and complexity in which we're tasked with meeting those needs. Social media and technology have opened the door to information overload. It's easier than ever to feel overcommitted to things that wouldn't have made your top 10 list a few years ago. So how are successful people adjusting? They live by priority. This doesn't mean you must say no to everything or become distant. Rather, decide what's most important and what's less important. Effective people have priorities. You only get 24 hours in a day. Establishing strong priorities will ensure that every second counts and allows you to avoid any opportunities to get squandered by the things that are less important. Where do health, family, and personal care fall on your priority list? Two, do you understand the demand? If you run a business, do you understand it? Here's a question the local gym didn't ask but probably should have. What stage is your company? Personal care looks very different depending on your business's state. For example, startups demand more flexibility since you're likely wearing several hats and have a reactionary schedule. Sound familiar? 
Try focusing on micro-fitness transactions like taking the stairs or doing push-ups in the morning. Briefly jog or power walk while listening to a podcast. Build a list of restaurants near the office and then make the switch from the burrito stand to the salad bar. You'll see a huge ROI. What if you're running a late-stage company? Well, you're used to planning in advance. Your schedule is packed, but you're in control. Is this you? Try anchoring your exercise schedule to appointments that don't move. Make sure your exercise is on everyone's calendar. Your assistant, partners, and even employees should know and respect your workout times. Stock the office with healthy foods and make it someone's responsibility to replenish the snacks, just like you would printer paper and office supplies. Three, buy health, don't sell it. Your health is a commodity. Let's be brutally honest. If you're successful, you probably got there by selling some of it. Every day, you have the opportunity to make a choice, buy or sell. If you skip your workout or hit the drive through to save time, you made a choice to sell. Press pause and take it from the experts. You're always making a good investment when you buy, not sell. Scheduling your workout or preparing your meals for the day is a buying decision. If this is something you want but fail to follow through with, find someone to hold you accountable until you've mastered it. It's worth every penny. You just listened to the post titled Physically Fit for the Fiscal Year, Realizing Your True Net Worth by Angelo Poli of metpro.co. And Angelo actually created MetPro, which is a cutting-edge coaching program that helps you transform your body. It works by analyzing your metabolism to give you a customized exercise and nutrition strategy. Whether you're a celebrity or someone who's tired of fad diets, MetPro works by studying your specific response to activity and diet. The methodology then provides you with simple action steps to get your desired results. MetPro's team of industry-leading experts don't play guessing games when it comes to what will work best for your body. Their expertise will help you take your nutrition and fitness progress to the next level. And Optimal Finance Daily listeners receive a complimentary metabolic profiling assessment and a 30-minute consultation with a MetPro expert. To claim this offer, head to metpro.co slash OFD. That's M-E-T-P-R-O dot C-O slash OFD. And that'll do it for today and for another installment of Optimal Finance Daily. Hope you've had a great Thursday so far, and I'll see you back here tomorrow for the Friday show, where your optimal life awaits.